Hello, I am Michael and I am here with Ryan and together we are Mayan. Today we are going to do part one of our Big Brother 18 cast assessment. We hope you enjoy, like our video, and subscribe. Thank you. So first we have Paul Abrahamian. He's 23 years old from Tarzana, California. He's a clothing designer, Ryan. That's interesting. For his, right. for his look, he's definitely not a clothing designer. Seems like he's kind of like a rock star kind of guy. He's being a rock man. He has tattoos all over. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, his his game, he seems like he's going to have a really big mouth and not be able to... Kind of like really Devin. Much. Yeah, a Devin In a way. character. Yeah, um, one of those staple kind of idiot characters. Yeah. <laughs> um, so... He says he loves to play music, so a jam season or session is all is always good, and he loves uh, going to shows and concerts. Yeah, that, that's kind of when I get so, from a rock star kind of guy. You know? Yeah. So he is used to being in a lot of crowds, but um, a lot of crowds of big people. But I don't know if, if the Big Brother house is what um, is good for him or not. So I ended up rating him 16 out of 16. He's definitely not, I don't think he has a chance of winning. He's, his mouth is too big, and I don't think he has a big of a chance. So, where do you rate him at, Ryan? I rate him a 15 out of 16, because basically what you said. There is, one, there is someone I hate slightly more. Yeah. Okay. So, next let's go down to Victor. So, Mr. Victor more of like a Hayden Jace type character, somebody that's kind of free spirited, yeah. looking for ladies really, not, yeah. not really there for the game. Yeah. 25 years old from Louisiana, he's a gym manager, so at least he knows how to organize people. So He likes working out, playing soccer, and taking trips with his friends, and those are some of the things he loves to do. But more than that, he loves women. So, I think Makes that <laughs> it seems so far that he's been with Natalie a lot. So, yeah, you can tell they uh, won. Yeah, they could be the new Nicole and Hayden. I, I don't know he's looking for that, but I, I, I don't know if Natalie would want work. to be with him. Yeah. He's just kind of creepy in my opinion. I think Victor definitely likes Natalie. I don't know if Natalie likes Victor. Probably not. But... So I ended up rating Victor at a 14 out of 16. He definitely, I don't think he's going to win. He might, but mm, probably not. How about you, Ryan? I rate him 16 out of 16 because I just, I don't like him. He's kind of creepy. Um, he's just, he's weird. He, I don't know. I don't like him. Okay. So, next up we have Corey Brooks. Corey, definitely a better player in my book. He's from Dallas, Texas, and 25 years old. What are your thoughts on him, Ryan? You know, I I personally like him more than, you know, the last two. Um, he just seems more like an Eric, in my opinion. Um, I don't know. I guess we'll find out. The only thing about Corey, he has that lazy eye, so I don't know about that. Yeah. So, uh, but other than that, he definitely seems like if he would team up with um, Polly. Cody's brother, it could end up being another Derek Cody situation yeah. right there. Corey and Polly. I, I think they could do it. So I ended up rating Corey at number one out of 16. He definitely is somebody I think has a good chance of winning this game. What about you? I rate him two out of 16 because, you know, basically what you said, I think he has a really good chance of winning. But there is someone I slightly think that they'll do better and just I slightly like their game more. Okay, so next is Polly Calfiori. He's 27 years old from Howell, New Jersey. He's a DJ and also the brother of Cody Calafuri. My favorite big brother player yes, from the season 16. Runner up from season 16, Cody Calafiori went with Derek to the finals. Made the mistake of taking Derek, however. It's I think if he would have took so. Victoria, he would have won. I, I honestly yeah, I would have won. Yeah. So, well, I rated Polly at number two out of 16 because I think he will have that edge with having 
um, his brother. He definitely has an edge with the veterans uh, this season because he has more of a connection to them knowing the Big Brother game. So, what about you, Ryan? I rate him 9 out of 16 because I think that he's just a bit too loud, kind of like Jason last season. He's just kind of loud and he's you know, I, I just don't think he has that great of a chance of winning. I mean, I know his... So next we have Bronte. Bronte! That squeaky voice that is going to annoy me. She sounds like she's been sucking on a helium balloon, <laughs> yeah. as Paul said. Pretty much. So she's <laughs> 26 years old from San Diego, California. Currently lives in Colorado. And she is a student. She doesn't know 9 times 9, but she is a math major still. So. Okay. So I think she thinks she's a little smarter than she actually is. Yeah, um, I think that she knows how to play Big Brother, but she really doesn't get the concept of a Derek or a Dan or yeah. a Dr. Will. I think that she has somewhat of potential, but nothing, I don't know. She, I doubt she'll win. She might make it far. I don't, she might end up being more of a floater. Yeah. She. Um, she just doesn't fit her body and personality. Her brain is in the wrong body, I think. But yeah. she's still, I don't know. I ended up rating her 11 out of 16 because I, I don't think she has much of a chance in the game. She might, but you never know. I rated her 7 out of 16 because I think that she'll be like a Victoria, but at the end, I think she'll win a lot more comps if she does get to the end. You know, that's, that's just my opinion. Okay, so next we have Bridget. So Bridget is more, she's quiet, but I think watching the feed, she is, um, she can make friends really easily. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She is 24 from Fresno, California, and she is a traveling nurse. So she knows how to think on her feet, so that could be um, something useful, especially when it comes to the double eviction time. Yeah. Um, but I don't know. I don't know. She might be able to do well. Maybe not. I rated her 12 out of 16. She definitely, she even said it herself, she's not going to be very good at this physical competition, which I think is going to hinder her in the end. That's exactly what I rated her 12 out of 16. Basically, what he said. I just think till she, that she'll be much of a floater. Um, I don't think she'll make any big. Okay, so next we have Mr. Frank. Frank is a veteran from season 14. He got about seventh place in that season, I think. Um, he was mentored by Mr. Mike Boogie. Uh, definitely a good person to um, to befriend. Uh, as Mike won the All Star season, so um, Frank is 32 from. Arizona, looks like. Originally from Charlotte, North Carolina. Uh, I ended up putting Frank at number eight. I think he has probably the best chance of all the veterans um, to end up winning it. However, he doesn't have the best chance. Uh, he probably has one of the best chances to also be the first one out of the veterans because he is a big threat physically and mentally. So. That's what I did. I right. rated him 4 out of 16 because I think socially he has the right, which I call it. I, I just think socially that he has what it takes to win. Also physically, I just think that. Next is Zakia. She's a preschool teacher. She is 24 years old. She definitely knows how to handle a bunch of people and a bunch of people running around. Um, I ended up putting her at number 7 out of 16. Because I think she has a good chance unless she ends up like a Dave Vaughn opening her mouth too much. How about you, Ryan? Same thing. I rated her an 8, so just same. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed the first half of our video. We will uh, upload the second half of our reviews very soon. Also, make sure to go check out my second channel, um, Scooters and Gaming. I will leave a link in the description. Go check it out. Subscribe. Um, if you guys yeah. like this video, definitely like and subscribe to the channel. So next though, nope, that's not gonna work. 12 seconds. <laughs> Same thing that you said. I just don't want to see it.